All right, I always get asked, which are the best all birds? These are my favorite. These are the tree runners. I just got a brand new pair and I want to show you how well they hold up. So this is the pair that I'm replacing them with. They're from 2019 actually. And you can see they've actually held up like really well. I haven't watched these you know, recently because I knew I was getting a new pair. The only thing that really didn't work and didn't last a whole long time was the shoelaces. I had to burn off part of it. But you can see the toe box, one of the biggest criticism of all birds, stays really well on these tree runner shoes. Here's a pair of uh, wool runners, which I honestly don't wear nearly as much as I do the tree runners because of the toe box issue. And it's kind of weird because I just don't want them to look bad. Um, so I don't wear them as much, which is silly, I know. You know, these shoes are more comfortable than these, but like this much, like that, like super little amount. These are just almost nearly as comfortable and they just last. I mean, here's another pair of, uh, this is my wife's pair of wool loungers here. You can see once again, the toe box just doesn't last like the older pairs of the tree shoes. All of my tree shoes have been a little bit better and holding that toe box, you still see, yeah, sure, there's sure a little bit of indent there. But if you want shoes that will last you the longest, I would recommend going with these, these uh, tree runners. I mean, you can see I've worn them quite a bit. Washed them, I don't know, probably 20, 30 times, but they still look good. And they would even look better if I had just washed them again. But people always ask me about all birds. They've changed a couple things in, on this style. You can see that the little circles, uh, inlets there are a little bit different. But other than that, they're pretty dang close to the same. It's a little bit wider of a sole. That was a little more of a creamy sole before. Looks like even a similar bottom sole there, but if you have any questions, what are the best all birds? We've got a whole closet of them. These are my personal favorite. My wife really likes these the most. They're just the most comfortable. Wears around the house, taking the kids to school, whatever, not, not a fancy shoe by, by any stretch of the imagination. But yeah, I do have this. They have really good insert series. So soft you can wear sockless. And that's true. I wear these without socks all the time. In fact, I'm about to go get my hair cut and that's what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna wear these. And uh, that's actually why I'm shooting this video real quick is because I wanted to show you before I put them on, before they got dirty, they're brand new. And there is just something special about wearing Allbirds for the first time again. You're like, oh man, you know, these shoes, they're pretty comfortable, I wear them all the time. But then you get a new pair of Allbirds. My wife just got a new pair of these a couple days ago. Put them on, you're like, oh, this is what they're supposed to feel like. After you wash them a couple of times, obviously the soles, um, and you wear them a couple of times, the soles get a little bit um, worn out. This is one little difference too, I just saw as I'm looking at this. You can see this uh, back tab here is a little bit thicker, a little bit different design, probably meant to last a little bit longer. I like that. Got a little bit more wool right there. <laughs> this is worn out on this one, you can see. But great shoes, love them, don't have, Hardly anything bad to say about them. I mean, they're about a hundred bucks. And for shoes that last me, I just checked 2019 is when I got these. So three years ago, they still look good. Wear these to run errands, uh, go get my haircut, that sort of thing. But have any questions or comments, please let us know below. And I hope to see you again real soon. Boop.